everyone! So today I am doing a very special collab video because I have the best guest star and it is Erin Reardon from How to Cook That. Hi! Thank you for having me. I'm so excited. Yeah, you guys might not recognize her face because most of her videos are like her hands baking things, but you probably know her voice because it's the greatest voiceover voice in the world. <laughs> do you want to tell, tell everyone about your channel? Sure, I do cakes, chocolates and desserts, but it's not ordinary stuff, it's all crazy sweet creations. And I'm obsessed with it, I watch every video. I'm just like, I could totally make that one day, maybe. So today we are gonna play the newly friend game because we are new friends and uh, we're just gonna get to know each other. Basically, I have a list of questions and then we're gonna write down what we think the other person's answer is going to be and we're gonna see if we get any of them right. So question number one, what is your favorite thing to bake? To bake, and I'm writing down what your favorite yeah, so thing to bake is. so what you think my favorite thing to bake is. I think your favorite thing to bake is cupcakes. Cupcakes, I don't think I've made cupcakes <laughs> since I was in college. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to bake then? Um, I actually make these muffins. Muffins are like pretend cupcakes, <laughs> pretending to be healthy. Yeah, it's like savory cupcakes, yeah. sort of. <laughs> so I put for you giant candy giant bars. Giant candy bars. Now see, I think you're kind of cheating because you can look at my <laughs> entire channel. That's a little one. <laughs> Um, favorite thing to bake would probably be anything I don't have to bake myself because by the time I've finished filming and everything I like it when other people <laughs> make stuff for me but I do like making giant candy yeah. bars. Next question. Yes. What is your favorite thing to cook? I literally don't know what you cook besides. Besides sweet yeah. That's all I cook. We just eat sugar all day long. <laughs> Did you know I'm a dietitian? Really? Yeah. So we actually do eat normal. <laughs> Normal food. <laughs> All right. What do you What do you think? I put rice and vegetables. Oh, close. Ooh, um, do I have? don't really ever make rice. I don't actually cook a lot, <laughs> <laughs> but I'd say yeah. I guess vegetables. Yeah, I'll give I'm you getting half. half a point for that. <laughs> I mean, a similar thing would be anything I don't have to cook myself. <laughs> of course. For you, I put fresh fish. Fresh fish. No. <laughs> every, <I don't. laughs> every TV show from Australia I watch, they're all like obsessed with seafood. <laughs> That's true. That's because we've got so much water. Mm -hmm. We're surrounded by water, so we've got heats. But I don't really like fish oh. so I usually favorite thing to cook is fast and easy so spaghetti bolognese okay so. what is your least favorite food not necessarily to cook just to eat to eat yeah. oh and now I nearly wrote mine down I've got to write yours <laughs> cheating so you already told me you don't like fish yeah but, but it's not maybe my least that's favorite. not your least no, favorite not. <laughs> but you might not have tasted what I was about to write down <laughs> Oh, this is a tricky one. Were you gonna write like Vegemite? Yes. I've never had that. <laughs> I was gonna write Vegemite. Ready? Yeah. Caviar. I've never had caviar. You've never had it. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say your least well, favorite I is? I think mine is the same that I put for yours because right. I think it's a pretty common least favorite food, which is mushrooms. Mushrooms. <laughs> I don't like mushrooms very much, but my least favorite is olives. Olives? Oh, I don't like olives either. Oh, I should have stayed with olives. <laughs> if you were on death row, what would be your last meal? This is so hard. Why did I write these questions? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is a tricky one. Are you ready? Uh-huh. Roast beef with vegetables and chocolate mousse and a giant Snickers bar. Because um, then you could delay your death because it's your last <laughs> meal. You could spend weeks eating that giant Snickers bar. I don't think it works like that. <laughs> You're half right. It would be all chocolate, just like all chocolate. All, all like every type of the most rich, like chocolate cake and fudge and ice cream and just everything sugar. There you go. Well, <laughs> I would take out the roast beef and vegetables and just have the chocolate mousse and giant Snickers. Can I have half there? <laughs> Yay. What did you think I would uh, have? So I put any type of cake but without fondant because yes. I assume fondant does not taste very good. It depends what you put with it. Fondant's just mm -hmm. sweet. It's just okay. nothing. So you can flavor it. Mm -hmm. But what would I have as my last meal? I think I'd like a dessert buffet. Yeah. And just, yeah, so, choose whatever you so, want. So the, yeah, cakes cake, would, yeah, I'll give myself half, half a point. So yep. we're both up to one point after like Ooh. four questions. One versus one. This is a question that um, recently was asked in this other kind of collab video that I was doing and I thought it was such a good question. Would you rather have a maid, a chef, or a chauffeur? Oh, that's an easy one for me, but I need to write down what you would like. I'm pretty sure I know the answer for you. You did say you don't like to cook, so I'm gonna go with chef. No, actually I would want a chauffeur because really? I don't have a car out here, so uh, I just want someone to drive me around all the time. And I didn't know that. But <laughs> <laughs> um, for you, I put a maid Definitely. to clean up all the, all the baking supplies. Definitely. Having a baking channel, there is dishes, but I've also got three kids, so mm -hmm. there is just, yeah, as soon as the house is clean, 
It, this stuff yeah. <laughs> so the next question is, if you weren't a baker or a YouTuber or a graphic designer, so like our three like main things, yes. what other job would you want? Okay. Okay. <laughs> doctor. No, I'm doctor. so bad at science. I, I think I'd be the a worst doctor in the entire <laughs> world. I'd be like, here's a band-aid. So I don't if you could look. do any job other than what you're currently doing, what would you do? Um, it would probably still be in kind of this like video production. You work in like the art department of movies. Mm, that would be fun. Yeah, so I put for you elementary school teacher. No. Because yeah, I mean, you, you teach in your videos and you have kids. And <laughs> That's true. And I like teaching. I just would not teach no. elementary school. No, I, um, I would probably... I think I looked into doing this years ago and then never actually did it, would go back and study surgery. I would like to do okay. surgery. Or if you could have dream job, uh -huh. astronaut would be cool just to check astronaut. it out. I mean, you've got to go to space <laughs> yeah. if you have the choice. Cool. <laughs> Nobody gets a point there. No, no points. If you could live anywhere in the world for six months besides where you currently live, where would it be? Mm. With the whole family, mm -hmm. paid for. So it's like all expenses paid, you just get to pick up and go somewhere for and six crazy. months. Kind of thinking of two answers at the same time. I'm trying to think of where would I live at the same time as where would you like to live? My guess for you, mm -hmm. Paris? Paris. Close. I think mine would be London. London. Yeah, I have a lot of friends there. It's a bit cold. Yeah, well, in the summer. I mean, the, the six, like the summer months. The summer months. <laughs> for you, I put France because France. they do a lot of baking there. They do do a lot of baking. I think if I could have an interpreter as well. Same. France. I don't speak yeah. French, so I could. France would be awesome if you could have an interpreter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next question. What is your favorite thing about Australia? Have you ever been to Australia? I haven't. <laughs> and I know you haven't tasted Vegemite. <laughs> Kangaroos or koalas? No, actually, my answer is all of the TV shows that you guys put out that are meant for teenage girls because <laughs> they put them all on Netflix here in the United States uh, and they are so wonderful. They have the best accents. They're about like mermaids and dance schools and surfing. There you and, go. Uh, they're my favorite things. What did you write for me? For you, I put the, the beaches. Beach. And That's the exactly scenery. what I was going to say. Really? The beach. <laughs> yeah, our beaches are just amazing. That They're just so beautiful. The sand is, mm -hmm. and there's not a lot of um, building and uh -huh. built up stuff on the beach. Mm -hmm. So you can go down, especially south coast of Western Australia, mm -hmm. it is just beautiful mm -hmm. beaches, huge waves and no high rise buildings, mm -hmm. just on its own. Oh, that sounds amazing. We have one last question. What is your favourite thing that you have ever made? Food wise or just across Anything. the board? Anything. It's a very general question. Okay. You'll never guess mine. <laughs> I'm going to put your YouTube videos. I was going to say my YouTube channel. I oh, think you go. Can I get three bonus points for that? It's close. Can I get half of the bonus points? Well, let's see if I got it right, too. Okay. I put your kids. Oh, that's such a good answer. That's not what I was going to say. Can I change it to that one? What were you going to say? I was going to say this family tree, I was thinking as in physical things mm -hmm. you've made, um, that we have on the wall mm -hmm. at home. That it's I really still like family related. It is family yeah. related. All right, well, that was so fun. I think we really got to know each other. Yeah, it was great. Thank you so much for having me on your channel. Yeah, thanks for being on my channel. And you're going to come over on my channel. Yeah, so we're doing another video over on Anne's channel with a few other people as well. And it should be really fun. I'm a little <laughs> nervous for it. So make sure you click somewhere around here to go watch that video. And I'm also going to link it right down below. Please make sure to go subscribe to How to Cook That because seriously, her cakes are the most amazing thing. Thank you. <laughs> and if you're new here, then feel free to subscribe to me. I put out new videos every Friday and sometimes Tuesday. And uh, yeah, I do a lot of crafting, DIY, graphic design. I hope you like it here. So leave a comment down below if you were playing along at home, if you guessed any of our answers, or if there were any answers that you were really surprised by. And I will see you all over on Anne's channel and also next week. Bye, everyone. See ya.